Hello, 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 my fellow artists. Welcome to Vibrant Ink Studios YouTube channel. Thanks for being here. I am so excited to have you guys here today. Today we will be going over this cute kitten uh, cartoon cat with Ohuhu markers. Um, but that is not the only thing that we'll be using on this channel. We'll be using all sorts of different mediums, um, pens and markers and color pencils and crayons and even some pottery and all sorts of good stuff here. So um, please join me for all sorts of different, you know, subject matters and whatnot that I'm excited to be sharing with you. And please join my Patreon if you are interested in getting the full real-time tutorial um, on this particular cat in all of my tutorials. So here you'll have your time lapse, but there on my Patreon you can find the outline as well as material list and everything you need to know to get started on this particular project guys so please enjoy and i will i will see you at the end all right bye so this is prim rose 121 as you can see right there and i'm going to use the chisel edge here um and i'm just going to start to color in so i'm going to go with my latest colors first and I am actually, I really need to lighten that outline a little bit more. So if you're downloading the outline um, in my Patreon, then you are definitely going to be getting a nice light uh, outline that won't bleed here. So I create those outlines for you and they are always there for you to download, print up, and use whenever you like. Now, if I was to use black first, then it would, and then I would go over with the cream, it's going to bleed into my light areas. So I don't wanna do that. I wanna use a light colors first. And I'm gonna go ahead, let's zoom in on that ear. As we move down here, I'm moving my camera down so you can see what I'm doing. So again, just gently going around these areas here where the whiskers are gonna be. And again, if you kind of color inside the lines, that is okay, guys. Hmm. I'm actually gonna And be careful, we don't want to color in the little nose there. We got like a little pink nose that we want to go around. So this is, this guy is be patient with this part. A lot of work here. Be patient, have fun. Maybe put something fun on the radio, some great music to listen to while you do this. Maybe you just enjoy listening to my voice. <laughs> All right, so we went around those whiskers around there. And now we're coming around here, the little mouth. We just wanna go, oops. So I colored it in a little bit and that is perfectly okay. So maybe I should just work with the smaller point here then I can, yes, I can go around a lot easier. See, even I'm learning here. And I'm going around this so I don't capture that graphite and then it bleeds into my drawing. So we don't want that. And I'm gonna come down here around, create a nice little outline. So this nice sharp tip really helps get it around these edges here. Thank you. 
with number 124. Number 20, 124 is going to be Shallow Earth. That's the name of the color. So I'm going to take the sharp edge here and I'm just going to go over around. And we can um, even go around here if we choose. We're just going to go around the eye. Just create a couple little, a little space around here. And we just want to be intentional with our lines. Um, and then, delicate little area there. Okay, a little hard to talk while doing that. So we have our lightest green number uh, 48 and that is going to, um, what color is that? 48 is yellow green. So we're gonna take that sharp pointy um, tip here. And so our lightest area is gonna be right in there. Yes, right in here. And guys, don't worry if you have different color colors in me they all work great so this area is going to be white we're going to keep it white um, of course I'm just going to clean it up a little bit there we're going to go um, it's going to really pop when we bring in that black marker so now we're going in with 47 which uh, which is what is 47 uh, 47 is going to be grass green or do I have yeah Let's go ahead and use grass green. Again, I'm going to use a sharp pointy tip here. And so we just have a little bit of it down here. So a very different color green here. And this really makes the eyes pop. We have these two varieties of, of green coming together. Now, one thing you might notice with the markers is that they can they can bleed a little bit. The colors of pigment can spread if you hold the pigment down too long on the paper. So you want to keep it moving, guys. All right. Let's go in with our black. So we're going in with the black now, guys. I'm going to go in with that nice sharp um, point and we're going to start. Now this is where you guys got to be intentional, be really careful with your lines. And you're going to do a great job either way. being careful really <clears throat> taking my time here just has this little bulge right here. And that's going to curve upward. And 
Okay, so we're getting that outline in. You're doing a really great job, guys. Keep it up, don't quit. And even if you make a mistake, don't worry, guys. Mistake, mistakes happen. They are just a part of the process. And then when we improve with every single drawing we do, it gets more and more beautiful. And then so I'm not gonna, there's no need to color in the white dot is there because it's already white. All right, so coming down here. and around. And back. Nice. And then we're gonna do this little, little eyebrow here. color it in with the chiseled tip is going to be bigger, fatter, and even here, um, it's not like there's a whole lot, so you can even use a point of the chiseled tip, you can just use that little point right there. Very satisfying, very satisfying. Get it all nicely colored in, a nice solid black in here. Very good, very good. So that is one eye down, guys, one eye down. Feel free to clean up any edges you wanna do if you wanna do that. And just that one little detail that I almost forgot. A little swoosh. And a little swoosh. And yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm, I think that looks pretty nice, guys. Pretty nice. 
All right, let's go ahead and grab our 124. Let's, if you've done a hand drawing here, we are just gonna lighten this up even more. So again, we don't have that bleeding of any kind of graphite or outline into our kitten's face. All right, so I grabbed number seven, which is Rose. So Rose for her little nose, which I think is really gonna be special. So, just jump, jump. So a little triangle, like a little upside down triangle, and that is it for her nose. I'm gonna actually take it out more, a little bit more. Um, yeah, nice. And don't worry, we'll go oh, clean this up with a black marker. Okay, let's grab our black marker. Okay, now we're probably gonna be just using this nice sharp point here and going around the ear. Again, guys, take your time. Nice curved lines. Rarely do we have just a, sh a straight, um, sharp uh, edge. You know, there's always a gentle curve to it. And that's gonna keep our lines looking really fluid, bringing this kitten to life. So sometimes my hands get a little sweaty and I just need like a little piece of paper to rest on so I don't get my drawing piece of paper dirty. Um, you do whatever you want to do.
And onward to her body, guys. So we are moving right along here. Really loving the progress we're making. I think it's looking really, really good, guys. Really good. So we're gonna take our, our 124 marker, kind of like an okra, also known as shallow earth. And we're just going to color around. And I'm gonna be even less careful here with where the lines are gonna be black. So here is not black. So there's really no black border. We wanna be careful around this area here. So I got my dark brown color. This color is called Runk. What a fun name there, Runk. So um, if you're using the Ohuhus, this is 129.
guys make sure those lines are still intentional still really clean still really crisp looking really good okay last one and there we have it guys we are done fantastic guys it looks fantastic i'm just gonna go over a few little things here and there clean it up am i using the right <laughs> oh my gosh see there i went in with the wrong marker okay i'm gonna blend it in with the correct marker and guys we are all done let's get a few all right, guys, we are all done with our piece. Here is the final full piece. Guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed it as much as you did. And find all my uh, materials and my outline and everything for you on my Patreon. Thanks so much, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.